the narrow alleyways of Madare, Nairobi County, meander across the vast slum neighborhood. For many youth, however, they provide a clear path to a better future. Boniface Mukindi is a prime example of defying one's background to achieve one's dream. The journey to his aspirations has, however, hit a snag, albeit temporarily. With the coronavirus pandemic forcing him to stay at home after schools were closed nationwide. Unlike many of his peers who have managed to continue with their learning at home using platforms such as e-learning to continue with their academics, Boniface, like many in slum areas, are finding this to be a challenge. It's party time poor because I lack some books. I don't have enough revision materials. The place that I come from is very noisy. And at Nasazingine, Masansi wana kam, Kusumbwa tuna nini uku, unapewa mboko, nini. With nowhere else to go, studying in his poorly lit home has become the only way for him to catch up with the rest of his colleagues, who fortunately have access to basic tools after the government encouraged the use of e learning materials. Una vita, una textbook zingine. You could say that this is an unfair advantage to many learners in similar circumstances, with the government failing to provide alternatives. And the many youth in slum areas, the script is the same. Crime is increasingly becoming enticing to them. Boniface, however, remains focused, looking at the bigger picture. My students are going to go home. They 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 are going to go home. Like Jana, I was going to go home from one. I was going to go home. 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 Mama changia sana, as in, ajaribu kuniambia, nireletu kusoma, niambia, nisi, nisi relay sana on the circumstance, mea ti circumstance kumusu nisome, aniambia, aniambia nikuwe kama eagle, aniambia the eagle loves the storm, nikuwe tu kama eagle. Na muambia jikinge na yo na kaya kwa nyumba na kitavu, aendele tu na vitavu, baka hii korana yisha. Studying at home using Koro Boys, or small lanterns is also risky, with fires often breaking out while he does his studies. He further tells me that though this public library was the last hope for many here, it was forced to shut down due to the coronavirus. Tunaumia sana because library ilifungwa, tunamali to access. Iso gadgets because most of the people in these slums, they are very poor. They do not even have what you call in internet access, so that the kids, as the government had said, they can actually be able to access reading materials via a smartphone and so on and so forth. Most of them cannot even afford a smartphone. In effect, the academic calendar might now become affected to the extent that school terms will likely be extended to December, with candidates also likely to sit their KCPE and KCSE in the last month of the year. A pandemic of global proportion that has no doubt caused almost everything to come at a standstill, including learning. And though e-learning has been introduced across the country, for some this has been a challenge in slum areas. Many are fighting against all odds to ensure that they too are not left behind. Shukriwachu K24, Madare, Nairobi County.